Well, it is a favorite in Hawaii, one that many of us grew up eating and continue to love. And this weekend, there's a festival that celebrates the canned meat. The annual Waikiki Spam Jam will be held. And of the participants, here is Duke's Waikiki General Manager Kelly Igovea and Executive Chef Bill Brule. Good morning and welcome. Good morning. Thank you for having us. Thank you for being here. I can't believe that Spam Jam is in its 17th year already. Yeah, it's crazy. It, it, every year, it gets more, it's bigger and more bigger fun and every bigger. year. Mm -hmm. And what can people expect this weekend? Oh, well, they can expect 20 restaurants, 15 retailers, three different stages, just music galore, all your local favorites. Um, some highlights would be like Alex Kawakami and friends. Mm -hmm. um, you can expect a ton of food, a good time, free entrance for everybody, and there's parking all over Waikiki, so you can't beat it. And Dukes will be there. We can expect Dukes there. And we Chef, will be there. what will Dukes be presenting this year? We'll be presenting our hula pie, which is our signature dessert, mm -hmm. but we're twisting it up a little bit with some candied spam. Okay, so, so you brought all the goodies. We render down our spam a little bit, fry it for a little bit, and then we brulee it with a little maple syrup. And we take that, and we dice it up, and we garnish our hula pie with it. Okay, so the popular hula pie with a kind of spam twist. A little mm -hmm. sweet and salty there. A little sweet, salty, mm -hmm. smoky, savory, all in the same. Kind of an umami uh, experience for, our, for, for those who enjoy hula pie. And you drizzle more chocolate. A little bit of hot fudge. Oh. Goes over the top of the pie. Now, this is a macadamia nut ice cream. Mm -hmm. Double premium. So it's very rich. We'll top it off with some heavy whipping cream. I thought we were done, but let's do it. <laughs> All and right. it really gets made like this every single day. Every single day. Every, every single, single day. day. Last year, it was your first year at the Spam Jam. And this year, again, you're bringing this back. So yep. That's what we'll be serving for anyone who wants dessert at Spam Jam. Oh. Once they're full of Spam Jalaya and all the other Spam-centric entrees, we'll, we'll be able to fulfill their sweet tooth. And why is Spam so popular here? Um... I, you know, my kids will tell you that they love it really, really crispy. Um, but it's just easy. It's accessible. I mean, Hawaii alone consumes 7 million cans of Spam a year. 7 million yeah. cans. So it's just, it can go with anything. It's part it's of our history meat. here. It is. Yeah, it goes, it goes way back. I mean, Spam Musubi, what a perfect mm -hmm. match, right? And speaking of Spam Musubi, I hear this year for the first time you're going to have an actual Spam Musubi making contest, which our own Kelly Simic will be a part of, and she'll be trying to make the best one there too, right? Do you guys have any hints that you can give her, any tips on how to make the perfect Spam Musubi? It's all about the rice. Oh, it's all about the rice. I yeah. like that one. Okay, well, I'm going to, there's four spoons here. I'm going to grab a spoon if Chris and Ross and Kelly are, are listening and they want to join in. They can, but let me tell you about Spam Jam. Just in case you didn't know, annual Spam Jam be held on Saturday from 4 to 10 on Kalakaua Avenue. No admission charge for this event. Music, lots of food, lots of Spam for you to enjoy. And, of course, a lot of goodies. I'm going to dig in, guys. Please if they do. don't come pretty Please soon, do. you know what? Please this do. is all mine. All right, some got to get the spam, the whipped cream. Okay, this is ooh, the spam went. Just got to get a little bit of everything. And this is oh, this ice cream is still so thick. There goes the spoon. There we go. Breakfast of champions. <laughs> Thanks, gentlemen. <laughs>